Hey, Nika, great question. So inflammation can come from many different sources. It can come from after you work out. It can come from eating fried foods. It can come from being exposed to toxic chemicals. It can come from not sleeping. Um, it can come from stress in life. It comes from a bunch of different areas. So how do you decrease inflammation in life? Well, take each one of the things I just mentioned and then probably some more and find ways of limiting, decreasing, eliminating all those things in your life that are causing inflammation, right? Uh, processed foods, uh, shop the perimeter of the store, avoid toxic people, or change how you function in terms of those context of those toxic people, like going to and brain work, things like that we talk about all the time, uh, avoiding chemical environments. Uh, yeah, thank you, Nessa. Makeup, uh, perfumes, uh, f you know, l beverages, like stop drinking pH balanced water because it's just going to jack your guts up even more than they already are. Um, you know, there's so many things. Stop putting the, the nice smelling creams on your body because they're full of toxic chemicals. Your makeup, you know, you're beautiful the way you are. Stop putting that crap on your face. You know, I know chrome might make you feel better, but if you're not loving yourself just the way you are, then that's a different story for a different day. Um, we love you just the way you are, and we want you to just live your best life. So um, take these ideas and run with them. Uh, just take one at a time if you feel overwhelmed, like, holy crap, that's a lot of stuff. Take one at a time. My my beauty products, my food, my exercise, my environment, the people in my world. Yeah, stop putting Glade in your car, you know, stop hanging things off your your rear mirror or the whatever you put in, you have the plugins. Oh my God, they're so toxic. Um, change your laundry detergent, go non-toxic, seventh gen, you know, things like that that are, um, you know, helping the environment, not hurting it. There's so many different areas. So. Um, hope that helps give you some ideas on how to decrease inflammation in your body. Um, you can do healthy foods, you know, eat the rainbow, uh, take fish oils. Um, you know, there's a plenty of anti-inflammatory foods out there. So um, do some research so that you get the win and you have the knowledge. Because if I just spit it out here, you're like, oh, that's amazing. But then if you don't do anything about it, like you gain something by doing the work to find it. And so I don't want to give you everything. I want to give you prompts in order to find them. So then you get the win. And you're like, oh, okay, this enters my knowledge base and I'm now wiser. I can share with other people rather than be like, go watch that video. Like you become, your, your, your life becomes your message. You start living the way you want to, to feel. And then you show everybody else and they're like, what are you doing? Right? It's pretty cool. So good luck. Hope it helps and let us know if you have any other questions.